Hey guys, Jason Cipriani here, a CNET How To Contributor. Today I'm going to show you how to enable group messaging on your iPhone. It's a feature that not many people know about, but one that can come in very handy when you need to discuss something with multiple people at the same time. Alright, so the first thing we'll need to do is we'll need to go into our settings, scroll down to messages, and then we'll scroll down to group messaging, and all you do is flip that switch on. So now when you go into your messages app, you're going to be able to send a group MMS, which everything you send will go to both of your recipients, how many ever you have, and then as well as it'll show you who the last message was from. It'll have their name right above the bubble. This comes in really handy for talking to friends and family, or even schoolwork as this person here had mentioned. So now that we know how to enable group text messaging on the iPhone, you need to make sure your friends and family members or whoever else you're going to be using the service with has it enabled too. If they don't and they reply to your message, it'll show up just as a regular conversation between the two of you. If they do, they'll be able to see all of the recipients as well as take part in the conversation within the group. I've had some mixed results when using this across platform with Android or Blackberry. Your results may vary. For more fun tech tips, make sure to visit howto.cnet.com.